1997. What a good year. Hey, CH. Hey, don't you ever knock? I mean, how you doing, buddy? Just kidding. Oh, you wondering what this is? Uh, since you brought it up. Oh, it's just blood, obviously. And I donate so much of it, you know? I just draw myself now. Oh. Give me a favor. Run this down to the blood bank for me, will you? Yes. Yeah. Thanks. I got your pizza, CH. Uh, your energy seemed a little low in that last scene. I don't know what I would do without you. Hey! What are you doing? There's garlic in that! Well, I, I mean, I'm allergic to garlic. Sorry, CH, my bad. It's okay. You're forgiven. Is there anything else I can get you? No. Hey, that's weird. You don't have a ref... ref refrigerator big enough for a star of your stature. <laughs> I'll go look into that. <laughs> Bad news, Tommy. Corey's a vampire. A real bona fide neck nibbler. I found him with this. Come on, he's not a vampire. He's just playing one in a movie. Besides, I thought he was a living saint. I didn't want to believe it either, but just hear me out. Fact. We only see him at night. Fact. He's quote unquote allergic to garlic. I don't know, Mern. It's not like he has no reflection. So <laughs> you didn't let me finish. Fact: He has no reflection. Oh my gosh! This is really bad. L Lori is on her way to meet him. Uh. You there? Hey, Mern. Hey, Corey. Hey, can you come by the trailer? Uh. Are you sure this can't wait? Afraid not, buddy. Tommy! <sighs> okay, Merton. The time comes in every man's life when he's got to show what he's made of. Sadly, that time has come. <sighs> Okay, the headband's a little effeminate. I don't like garlic, so I'm a vampire? Yeah, yeah. Maybe you're right. I guess, I guess I overreacted, huh? Time for the old steak to the heart. <laughs> Merton, what are you doing? Save it, Corey. I know your secret. Okay, so you're trying to kill me because I'm a Canadian? Actually, no. I was referring to you being an undead bloodsucker. Oh! I've brought down bigger vampires than you, Haim. Although none as handsome and talented. You're gonna bite me now, aren't you? No, I don't think so. You look really sick and pale to me. What are, what are you, anemic? Look, you can do what you want to me, but you better not hurt Lori. <laughs> Lori, Lori, no, I kind of like Lori. As a matter of fact, you know, before the night's through, I'm gonna suck her blood and make her my vampire bride. Oh, congratulations. If you need an usher, die! Uh, <laughs> okay, buried alive. No need to panic. <laughs> What now, Tommy? Corey, are you okay? Run got this crazy idea that you were a real vampire. <laughs> yeah, I know. He came in earlier, and I set him straight. <sighs> God, you can get a little carried away sometimes. Uh, I bet. Listen, we gotta go to the cemetery and shoot one scene before sun comes up, so... Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Bye. All right. Have fun. See you, buddy. <clears throat> I think we both said some things we didn't mean. Martin? Is that you, buddy? Tommy! You've got to stop Corey! No, no, no. It's cool. I just talked to him. You were wrong. He's not a vampire. Phew! Glad you had your little chit-chat. But I'm gonna stick to my guns on this Haim vampire theory. 
you know, this is really starting to get on my nerves. If he's a vampire, you better have some serious proof this time. Here's some things you may want to consider. A, he told me he's a vampire. And B, he's buried me alive. Oh, yeah, and C, he's going to bite Lori and make her his vampire bride. He just took Lori to the cemetery. I'm going to stop him. Although saving Lori first may seem like the best idea, you should note that while girls come and go, friends last forever. <laughs> Unless they're running out of oxygen! <laughs> <laughs> what do you think you're doing? I've been searching centuries for a girl like you. Centuries? Your bio says you're 27. I've had some work done, you know. But hey, enough about me. It's time to make you my bride. I think we should just be friends. So you really are a vampire. Don't you think that's a little melodramatic? I'm just trying to set the right mood. Do you take Lori to be your vampire bride? I do. Sorry, Hank. Wedding's off. A werewolf. And this ain't makeup movie, boy. <laughs> Starting to hallucinate. Oh, look. A unicorn. Burton, where are you buried? According to my calculations, I'm exactly. Dusted Haim, but I still had some digging to do. Wow! Oh. Merton! Merton! Oh my gosh, we're too late. No! Haim's not a vampire. He just plays one in a movie. Don't listen to Merton. He exaggerates everything. Mm -hmm. 